Hey, this is Greg again, and uh, here I am today. Ford F-350 Power Stroke V8. It's lifted. Lots of stuff done under the hood. Six liter. And uh, I'm here to show another product, and that is the Ford Mazda and its specific ELM devices. Now, that you don't have to use it on a special lifted truck or, or a Mustang. You can use it on any Ford or Mazda vehicle. Now, these are simple things. They plug into your, your OBD. Like I already have my, have my tuner plugged in. I'm gonna unplug it. Now, sometimes it's over on this side. Sometimes it's over here. The, uh, the OBDs, the ELMs that I have, uh, they are certified real ELM devices as opposed to the um, vast majority of them that are uh, that are just cheap copycats. Um, and I, I have the proper ones for both the Ford uh, Mazda specific and also for the uh, BMW specific. Anyways, I have the Ford Mazda one in two different kinds. I have the Bluetooth and in the USB. If you're going to use the USB, it works just as well, maybe even better. Um, the tablets that I sell, like the combo packs or just the tablets, uh, they all come with this little adapter kit. And it's got the, uh, the female USB that you plug that into. And then you plug this this micro USB into the laptop or the, now this one here this Bluetooth does not work on on Apple devices and so you may be able to get away with this one here on, on an Apple device um, with the correct uh, with the correct adapter however I don't sell those adapters today like I said we're using this OBD plug it in again Cycle it to key on, engine on, key on, engine off. Make sure your Bluetooth is on. Perfect. Go home. And I take my foreskin light. I just updated it. It's fairly simple looking. Settings. Make sure that you have that you're doing Bluetooth. That you set your adapter to Bluetooth one, because it automatically goes to Bluetooth zero when you're doing Bluetooth. And if you're doing USB, use USB. Vehicle. Hit the uh, connect button up in the top right. We're going to find out if this is going to be in the correct bus or not. It looks like we're in the correct bus, so that's good. And if you're not in the correct bus, down here on this one, you've got a switch. You flick the switch, you become in the correct bus. And then it asks you this. If you're using the kind that I sell, make sure you hit the yes button. Then you go to errors. And your transmission looks fine. I've got glow plug. My parking aid module's failed, which I already know. My overhead trip computer, which is up here, I've got an internal circuit failure, which I know. So now all these things are fairly normal to my truck. I just reset all of them just in case.
and now setting up PCM all sorts of different cool things So now those are all set up. Okay, I'm going to go back into there. And we can save a PID profile. Now you go to your table. And you can clearly see that I've got a few different things here. Okay, I'm going to try turning on the AC and see if it changes the... Said, you can go back into your dashboard and see how things are going up here. You can actually run tests, lots of tests. I'm not actually going to run them on here. If you want to disconnect, hit the disconnect button. Disconnect from vehicle. All right, so you like your your Ford Mazda vehicles, and from what I understand, you can also use it on Hyundai's and Kias. Check these out; they work great. You get them with the four scan. You buy them off our website. Uh, so you know that they're legit. Whiskmarketing.com. Free shipping anywhere in Canada. Um, we're going to do the uh, a tutorial on the BMW next week. And hopefully um, uh, get on the tuning of these vehicles. And what you can actually change on the, uh, on the actual Fords themselves. With the full version which is in um, on the PC. Um, as uh, both uh, the Forescan PC version and as the uh, ELM config and possibly as Focus. Uh, there's lots of things to explore, lots of things to do, and uh, yeah, basically your possibilities are endless uh, for a really good price. Thanks for watching the tutorial. Check us out.